Hello and welcome again. In this video, we are going to explain how to get a CE certificate for your machinery against 2006 42 EC requirements. So the first step is that we have to identify all applicable directives. In this case, it is of course machinery directive. But you have to verify because other directives like ROHS, battery and EMC directive may also apply. Second step is going to be identifying applicable standard. One of the most generic machinery safety standard applicable is going to be EN 60204. But sometimes you have a better and more specific machinery standard for your machine. In that case, you have to apply that. In the next step, once you have your machine redesigned, you have to do a risk analysis. There is a considerable guidance given in EN 12100 for conducting risk analysis for a machinery. In a risk analysis, you have to consider what if situations that can pose a risk for the user. And for each such situation, you have to take actions to eliminate risk or to reduce by substitution or to in introduce a engineering control. For example, for a risk of inverse polarity of phases, you introduce a phase protection relay. Sometimes, you also put guards. The last control is going to be personal protective equipment. All this information of risk analysis is also very important as a part of instruction for use. So, the more detailed the risk analysis is, the better. In the last phase, once your machine is ready, you should get your machine tested against EN 60204. One of the tests that is included in the EN 60204 is ground bound continuity. There are more than 25 inspection points according to 60204. And these have very specific requirement. While the ground bound continuity may look very simple, it has some specific requirements like color coding of the grounding wire. It should be green coded with small lining of yellow. The cross section of the grounding wire depends upon the current that is going to be passed through the equipment. The labeling should be in a way so that it is not easily removable. And the finally, continuity is checked by testing. So do the risk analysis and get your product tested against EN 60204 or any other specific standard and then apply CE marking. Thank you.